Good news coming out of the club, we hear Efron Mason Clark has signed a professional contract. You must be chuffed. Yeah, signed this morning, absolutely delighted. Always nice to see when players, particularly someone like Efron, who has been at the football club for a number of years. I coached him six, seven years ago when I was here just as a part-time coach. And now when you're academy manager, to see that player really get over the line and make that first step on the road to becoming not just a professional footballer, but a real fully-fledged professional footballer and making multiple appearances for the first team. Really good to see and everyone fully deserves it from the work that he's put in, not just this year, but like I said, for the six, seven years that he's been at the academy. Um, right from when he, back when he was recruited by the old academy manager, James Thorne, um, from when, back when his time when he coached him at Chelsea after him being released from that. It's been a really big year for him. He obviously made his debut for the first team. Been catching the eye, I imagine, with Martin. Gone out on loan now as well. How pleased are you with his development over the first few months of this season? <clears throat> well, he's been outstanding. Really, he's kicked on. He had a tough injury, broke his collarbone uh, at the at the back end of last season. So he had 16 weeks where it was all rehab orientated and really looked at so building in a real good strength program program for him. Back end of last season, he looked really fit and he came back hungry. Permanently been with the under 21s throughout the whole uh, throughout the whole of the start of the season. Like you've mentioned, dipping in with the first team as well. He's played some youth team games. When he's played in those youth team games, his performances have been absolutely outstanding, and they've been founded on really some you know key values that we've had here at the academy and the football club as a whole um, and his work ethic is one of the really striving for excellence and he's strived for that and delivered on that for a number, on a number of occasions which is why it's been reflected by him being offered and signing a professional contract to the club. And he's obviously been out on loan with Met Police and done well there, what have you heard back from them speaking to their management? Well their management are very um, you know, very pleased with perform his performances but it's not, not just that, we've got members of staff who have gone to watch himself, I've been down twice twice to watch Efron, <clears throat> you know, he, in, in his first game there he was responsible, he was assisted for two, for two of the goals and <clears throat> you know, he's thoroughly, he's done nothing that I wouldn't have expected him to do when he's gone, he's gone there, he's, looked like he's more than capable of playing men's football and I'm fully expecting him when that loan comes to an end to come back and I've made it quite clear to him, I expect him to be you know, knocking, on the first, knocking on the first team's door and not just thinking I want to be a starter for the 21s but I want to be part of that 18 man squad for the first team and really looking to kick on from there. And for those who haven't had the fortune of seeing him, can you tell us a little bit about what he's like as a player? What, what's, what's his strength? So his number one strength is his um, power physically and his speed. And then it's his skill uh, on the ball and his finishing skills. He's played predominantly as a centre forward throughout this year, but can play any of the front, any of the front three positions. And uh, he looks to stretch the play in behind powerful to hold off defenders, scores a number of goals when he's playing there, but also is able to show the intelligence to drop the ball, a drop in, receive defeat and look to link the play. So he really is a good player to have on your side because he's multi-dimensional and allows the team to play in a variety of styles, which obviously makes it hard for the opposition to play against. Fantastic. Thank you very much. Thanks, Tom. Excellent.